Hey fellow crypto enthusiast, welcome to today's quick trend analysis. Let's get straight to it. In today's video you will find out how the price of Bitcoin has changed and what the technical indicators SMA, Divergence, Stochastic RSI and MACD are showing. If you are not familiar with the indicators, check out the explanation videos down below in the description. If we look at the hourly time frame for Bitcoin, the price went up only slightly with around 0.9% in the last 24 hours, with a current price of 50,459. Looking at the hourly simple moving averages, the current price is between the 20 and the 100 SMA. If the price bounces off the 20 SMA which is currently at 49,816 it could be seen as a support and the 100 SMA that is at 52,351 could be seen as a resistance to the upside. Breaking either way signals a possible further move to the corresponding direction. Searching for divergence in the hourly time frame, there was a bullish divergence and the price already went up. Moving to the hourly stochastic RSI, there are no signs of the stochastic RSI being oversold or overbought at this time. Looking at the hourly MACD, seeing as the MACD line is above the signal line, meaning that the trend is currently on the up. Looking at the MACD histogram, we can see that the momentum is strong at the moment and we can expect the price to continue growing or maybe at least remaining the same for some time. Jumping to the three hourly simple moving averages, at the moment, the price is between the 20 and the 100 SMA. If the price bounces off the 20 SMA which is currently at 49,743 it could be seen as a support and the 100 SMA that is at 51,099 could be perceived as a resistance to the upside. If there were to be a break either way, it means that there could be a continuous move in that direction. For longer price development, the daily time frames should also be considered as the shorter time frames are not as accurate. Jumping to the three hourly stochastic RSI, both the percent %K and percent %D lines are located in the higher region. This means that the price is high due to overbuying and a change in the trend, or at least some kind of consolidation, can be expected. Nevertheless, the K line has yet to cross the D line, so it's recommended that you wait and see if the trend does in fact go down. Jumping to the three hourly MACD, seeing as the MACD line is above the signal line, meaning that the trend is currently on the up. Looking at the MACD histogram, we can see that the momentum is strong at the moment and we can expect the price to continue growing or maybe at least remaining the same for some time. Looking at the daily simple moving averages, the current price is above all simple moving averages for this time interval, which looks bullish and it is to watch if the closest SMA, the 20 SMA could hold support or the price will break it to the downside below the current price of around 48,387. Searching for divergence in the daily time frame, there was a bearish divergence and the price already went down. Looking at the daily stochastic RSI, we can see that the crypto is being oversold because the percent %K and percent %D lines are in the lower region. A change in the trend can be expected or for the crypto to remain at least stable for some time. You should wait to see if there will be an upward trend to the crypto because the K line has not yet crossed the D line. Moving to the daily MACD, the MACD line is below the signal line, which shows that the current trend is on the downside. We can expect for the price to continue going down or perhaps remain at least stable because the MACD histogram shows the momentum currently being strong. In general, the larger time frames have a greater impact on the price, so please remember that when we display different time frames with different indicators. And also the shorter time frames are only representative for the short-term trading. Thanks for watching and know that every few hours new videos are uploaded analyzing different cryptocurrencies, so be sure to hit subscribe and not miss out. If you have any questions, leave a comment below and we'll get back to you ASAP. Also, Keep in mind that you should make your own investment decisions as cryptocurrency trading is very risky and these daily videos are only an overview of trends and are a purely technical analysis without considering the fundamentals. See you next time. See you next.